Democrats today queue up several of their high-profile initiatives for votes in the Minnesota House. Bills for free school lunch and breakfast for all students earned sick and safe time. And allowing felons to vote after they rele- they're they released from prison make what could be their final committee stop before a vote in the full House. Later in the day, there's another hearing in the Senate on legalizing recreational marijuana. Two House committees meet jointly to get input from the stakeholders on the proposed merger of the Fairview and Sanford Health Systems. Attorney General Keith Ellison wraps up his series of statewide listening sessions on that issue tomorrow in Grand Rapids. The Minnesota House will vote on a bill today that would allow undocumented residents to obtain a driver's license. Republican State Representative John Petersburg of Wasika pushed for different licenses for immigrants to prevent illegal voting. Representative Aisha Gomez says there are a number of different immigration statuses that people can have where they do not have the right to vote, but they do have access to a Class D driver's license. Officials from law enforcement, business, labor, religious, and farm groups spoke in favor of the driver's license for all bill.